am so excited. I just got my Gator all-terrain utility cart. And it, uh, the box is my prompt here. Multiple configurations, rugged tubular welded steel frame, non-skid grip loading surface, uh, non-pneumatic all-terrain tires. That means you don't have to keep airing them up. And um, I've had a gear cart where we had to air up the tires. It was such a pain, such a pain. So I'm really pleased that these are not that way. This was super simple to put together. First of all, all I had to do was put the wheels on. So this one has a bolt that comes up through here, put the washers and the nut on, tighten it up with the little um, screwdriver-ish things they sent along. Both of the front wheels done. Rear wheels, put the wheel on the, on the axle. There's this wide nut that goes on there. And then, um, oh, the whatchamajiggers that I forgot what they're called. Anyway, put that in there. Get a pair of pliers to pull it. Needle nose are better, but I had these handy. So I just tightened it down a little bit. That's it. It's done. Um, it did come with um, this uh, soft surface kind of stuff to put on here. So I did go ahead and put that on there. Um, not because any of my boxes are going to get scratched up because I put them through their paces, but this will help create some um, uh, friction so that they don't slide off quite as easily. So I did go ahead and put it on there. These pop up like so and like so. Super easy. And then when you want to take them down, see? It says step down to fold handle, push that down. Let's see if I can do this and hold my camera. Push that down, and the handle goes right down. Get them. Um, the other great thing is, let me pull this back up. The uh, gator extends quite a bit. Let me see. I'm going to show you on the box because you can extend it out so it's much longer pile a whole bunch of stuff on it you can leave one of the handles down just have one up um you can have it shorter with both handles up like i've got it here now or have one handle up or have both of them down and just use it for you know like under a freezer or a fridge or a big box or something you can extend it and do that you can have it upright like you would or compact so this position that it's in right now is probably the way I will use it the most, Ma mainly because what I do, I do a lot of location live streams where I set up in, in a wide variety of places. And this will allow me to wheel my stuff into, if I'm going into a convention center, I can load this up and wheel a whole bunch of things into a convention center if i'm shooting at um i've got some festivals where i shoot where it's big tents but it's on a big gravel parking lot and the small wheels on regular gear cases just don't hold up i have actually boogered up quite a few and that was part of the reason i went with the all-terrain version of this gator gear cart and I am so excited to be using this. I'm probably going to use it around here just to haul stuff back and forth between my trailer and my bus while I set some stuff up but it's going to get used. I can guarantee you that. I am very pleased with this puppy.